my name is Don Hauser, and uh, I'm uh, down in Cuba with um, uh, my band that I play with. Uh, I'm from West Coast Canada. I'm involved with uh, with a community band on a little island on Vancouver Island, off of Vancouver, and um, we decided to come down to see how some of the uh, other people live and how they experience music. And it's been a very fulfilling trip. Um, especially meeting some of the young kids that are involved with music and how dedicated they were and how happy they are doing what they're doing and it was uh, such an emotional feeling to to see their their excitement and uh, enthusiasm about music and uh, we had about 25 musicians with us and uh, we played six concerts in seven days and it was so much fun um, very enjoyable and uh, well, I'm, I'm involved with quite a few other musical groups back in Canada and uh, we're talking about bringing an 18-piece band down here, a Glen Swing Band, and I think that will be really fun and uh, I'm looking forward to doing that again. And I'm a member of the Sydney Concert Band and we've just had a visit here in Cuba, my first visit to Cuba. I have traveled in many countries around the world. I have been to many countries and I've never felt so welcome as I felt here. And I looked into the faces of the young people and I remembered being one of those young people. I began to play the saxophone when I was 15 years old in high school in a small town in Pennsylvania and um, I loved music and then I picked up another instrument and another instrument and everything I picked up I loved so I put it away after university on the shelf my tenor saxophone and then at age 65 I took it out again and I could still play it so I say that no matter what age you start you can always pick it up again and play it again and in the meantime you can enjoy all the music you hear because you've had that experience of learning to read music and to play music together I love it so here I got to play my tenor saxophone next to two professional provincial saxophone players one of the best experiences ever and looking into the lovely faces of these young people it was great I loved it. So my name is Paul Schweigley. I'm with the Sydney Concert Band and I'm here in Cuba and we've been here for almost a full week and it's just been a, a wonderful experience uh, to play with other bands, to enjoy the the music, the, the music of the Cuba, Cuban people, but to, to also play our music, the Canadian music, and have them play it as well. It, it, it has just been an, an emotional, I, I can't really explain it, it's been very emotional. Uh, it, music is, is a language that everyone can speak. I don't speak Spanish, but I can play music with uh, somebody that speaks Spanish from Cuba, and we can play the same thing, and we have a connection there. The, the sights, the, the food, the people have just been wonderful. And uh, I would suggest this to anybody. It has been the greatest trip that I have been on. So I want to thank Canada Cuba because it's been great. There, that town, um, uh, we played right in front of one of the main, the main square in a, par a park in the city. And what surprised me is how as soon as we started playing, the audience, the crowd, the, the hall just filled up and uh, the mall, the square filled up. Uh, people from all over, as soon as they hear music, they come running and, uh, and they're all bouncing up and down and, and, and clapping with the songs and uh, yeah, it was a, a str to get a, get a response like that from a, from a crowd is really rewarding for the musicians. Yeah, that, um, that was uh, very exciting as well. It, we had uh, about 60 musicians and uh, we got together and played joint numbers and uh, uh, the audience was very receptive. Um, that's one thing we found down here, not only the musicians but the audience really seemed to enjoy music they, and, and the feeling they have for rhythm uh, was, uh, 
we had a, a rhythm, a workshop, just for percussive instruments, and we all experienced, learned a lot from that. Uh, uh, we just, we love to bring some of you guys back to Canada so we can uh, beef up our percussion section to show that we got some rhythm. Hi, my name is Karen Palmer, and I'm from Sydney, BC, in Canada, and we've just played a wonderful concert in Cuba. It was just wonderful seeing the young people being so attentive and so patient in waiting for us and their musical performances was outstanding and they loved playing with the drums afterwards. <laughs>
we 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 planned a week down here, and I, I thought, um, oh, a week will be enough. It'll it'll be plenty, but you know, there's so much that we could have done, and next time we'll probably come a little longer. Yeah, we went to a concert with the Haitian Cuban community, and uh, the energy uh, that was there was absolutely beyond. Uh, this uh, this show was uh, intense to the point where it was a, a series of crescendos, crescendo after crescendo, and uh, it just never stopped. And then in the end, uh, they gave us an opportunity to go and play with them. So I actually had a chance to sit down and actually play some of these rhythms with them and listen to how the rhythm that I was playing fit in with the one they were doing. Uh, it was uh, an experience that uh, that I won't soon forget. Uh, I can, I'm sure that if I danced like that for, uh, for even part of my life, I'd be a lot lighter than I am right today because the energy that went into it, it's electrifying. David just wanted to say a few words. A thanks to you and the project that you're part of. Uh, we've been able to achieve these objectives uh, with uh, the contributions that we've arranged to bring from Canada in the past year we've been able to support a growing band program in eight communities around the city. Yeah.